Hi everybody! Today we have an update as a new version. It's Peak Needle 2. And as you can see, um, a lot of things changed in the Peak Needle plugin. So um, let's see what happens and play some music. <laughs> So as you can see, um, it's still the peak needle, and um, you can change um, the range um, of the meter scale, and you can change the calibration of the um, internal 0 dB um, to up to minus 40 uh, dBFS, or 0 dBFS just to your taste. You can still change the meter speed or the needle speed from very slow to very fast. I'm going to show you. And you can set a target. That's um, the features over here. And now let's get to the knobs over here. So um, what we saw was a peak a needle for the maximum peak of the left and the right channel. And you can also um, set that to a two needle mode. So the red needle is uh, the right channel. And you can also set that to true peak mode. So it says stereo true peak, or just uh, the maximum peak for both of the channels in true peak. You could also meter RMS um, values. And you can also meter loudness values. So the integrated loudness, um, short time loudness, momentary loudness, and loudness range. And you can set that to a VU meter. Um, then it's always to minus 20. Uh, so the range doesn't matter. But you can still calibrate it and set uh, the needle speed. And um, the target is always um, set to 0 dB from the internal 0 dB by calibration. Um, the VU meter also uh, has a 2 meter mode. And down here um, we can choose if we want to have numbers displayed. So I can choose full scale now it shows minus 20 because the needle is all the way down. And in VU meter mode, um, it displays a stereo true peak. Um, so left channel, right channel. Um, the yellow uh, LEDs indicate um, which um, values, which numbers are displayed here. You see um, what the yellow uh, LEDs show. Okay, you can set the number display to um, internal calibration. So you see it switches here to um, what I did with the calibration. Let's say we have a difference from 10 dB. And you can set that to a hold mode, so we have a peak hold. And this is um, now um, set to the calibration, and therefore it's not a negative value. If I put the calibration to 0 dB, it's equal to the full scale, and we still have the negative um, values here. 
in some cases, it just shows uh, these two lines here, and this means um, we have no numbers to be displayed. Um, for example, in the range mode for the loudness, um, we can't use a hold mode. We can always use a live mode. The integrated loudness doesn't show a uh, value if you click on hold, um, so don't click on hold for that. Um, but you'll figure that out yourself. Uh, if there's uh, no value displayed, um, check if it, it's better if the hold um, knob isn't pressed. And don't worry um, if there's uh, nothing shown and the needle doesn't move. Uh, during the first few seconds in the loudness mode. That's completely normal. Loudness meters uh, need some time to um, to get their measurements. So here it's fine. In um, short uh, mode it needs some time. And this is because um, short mode and range mode um, need a um, time window of three seconds. The version is not really um, done yet. It's not uh, completely uh, what I wanted to do, but I thought um, I'd share it uh, in this state so you can try it. Um, one day it will be like um, you can alt click on the um, buttons here. Uh, to make them show the yellow light and just click to show the red light. So you can uh, have a needle and a different value is displayed. To get the new version, just update the MCP meter package in Repack um, because um, Peak Needle 2 still comes uh, bundled with the MCP meter. And just reminds me when I say MCP meter that you can now um, put that into the uh, TCP or MCP um, mode and it scales uh, wherever you want and it doesn't have this black empty space like the peak needle in the version before. So as always, have fun with the plugins and bye bye.